Hello everyone and welcome back to another plan with me. So this week I've decided to use this travel kit from Planner Face because I am getting ready to go camping next week. So it's kind of like traveling, kind of not like traveling. And to be honest, every time I see this kit in my stash, because I have had this for a while, I am just reminded that I'm not going abroad this year or not going on holiday. I'm not traveling this year. So, you know, I just wanted to use it because kind of getting ready to travel-ish. So this is a mini kit and like I said I have had this for a while so I'm not even sure if it's still up in her shop but I'll leave uh, Planner Faces link down in the description box as I always do. Um, so we're just going to jump in. I did white out all of the dates at the top and the black line so I could put the date headers down and also the washi over the black line. There are two sets of kind of thinner washi so it's like a full washi that's been cut in half there was the silver one that I've used under the dates and there's also a pink one that I will be putting oh <laughs> along the bottom every time I sit down to do a voiceover my phone makes a noise let me just put that on silent real quick okay hopefully we won't be interrupted anymore the boys are outside playing with water balloons so who knows we may be interrupted but starting off on Monday I had work as I usually do so I put that on a half box and just used one of my little poppets from the feeling sheet. I also wanted to remind myself to put some laundry in before I went off to work and that way when I got home it was all washed and then I just had to dry it so to remind myself I just used one of the little heart icons. I used a poppet laundry sticker which is from my shop and just wrote down to remember to do the laundry and then underneath there I'm going to be putting two page flags and the little microphone that I've put on top is just a sticker that I drew for myself and that is to mark to do this plan with me voiceover and I've also got a sims video that I need to do a voiceover to which will go up on my sims channel like later on I also decided at the bottom of each day I've put one of the shorter heart checklists and that's just to uh, mark down things that I'm going to be doing every day because I've got so much to do before we head off camping like just trying to get all the camping gear together and make sure that we've got everything or enough for five people is sometimes really stressful even though I do it every year and you'd think that I can just click my fingers and I know exactly what I'm packing I know exactly what I'm doing and every year I stress out about it so I decided to ease the stress I was going to list three things on each day that I would be getting ready so then I've got like a starting point I know what I'm doing and then by Friday is when I'm going to pack like everything into the car and things it should like already be done and there's no like scrambling or worrying that I forgot something so um yeah that, that's why I've put the heart checklist just at the bottom because I'm just going to be doing it throughout the day or when I've got some space to try and ease the stress let's hope it works so moving on to Tuesday I started off with a full box up at the top I then put a glitter header down just to cover the black line and then I used some of the wider washi that I used at the top the leftover piece just to put behind this half box that I flipped up onto its side because I wanted to try and get some of the orders done on Tuesday as I'm doing my voiceover today on Monday it frees up Tuesday so that way I can get ahead of myself and make sure that everybody's orders is done before I go off on holiday I've been kind of toying with the idea of closing my shop down just for the week just while I'm away so that way when I come back I I'm not really far behind on orders or I feel really I don't I don't know the words to say but I was just thinking about maybe closing my shop for a week I've never done that <laughs> my shop's been open for two years nearly and I've never shut my shop so I'm kind of scared that my shop just won't come back or something <laughs> I don't know I hit random buttons sometimes it wouldn't surprise me if I deleted my whole shop so I may get someone else to um, find out how to put that on like holiday mode I'm not sure what the mode is called but just for a week just so I'm not behind as soon as I come back from holiday um, as well as uh, doing everybody's orders I am going to upload this plan with me I've got a sims video that has to go up and my daughter is going to be babysitting my nephew so I just marked that down and the little stickers were from the baby poppet sheet and then for Wednesday I've started off with an appointment label at the top and the little pencil sticker is just one that I doodled for myself and that is just to mark down to answer any comments on my videos and things so I've caught up on all of those and then I want to head out to the post office first thing in the morning and just post everybody's orders I put a glitter header down just to cover up the black line and then I put the little fork and knife sticker down here oh my cat walked in my way <laughs> he's always jumping up um, and that was just to remind myself while I'm out I'm just going to be buying stuff for dinner because I haven't done like a proper big shop as we're going away it's kind of like well 
I'll just buy something every day that we're going to be having. Yeah, <laughs> it's not going well. <laughs> we keep having junk food. Um, after that, I need to make sure that I have bought a pump because our hand pump broke. So we've got like an electric pump that we pump all of the mattresses up with when we're camping. But you really need like a hand pump to finish them off because they don't blow them up fully. If you go camping, you'll know what I mean. And then um, I've got a bill due, which is for the rest of our pitch for the week. And then it was just my three hut checklist of what the things were that I'm going to be doing that day. And then flipping it over to Thursday, I've got my bullet journal video that I need to upload. So for the first is on Thursday. And I wasn't sure whether to upload it on the first, as obviously that makes sense, or wait until I'm away so you guys have got another video. But if I do uplo upload it on Thursday, then I'm going to need to film some other kind of video for next week. So that way something's going up on my channel for you. So I'm not sure what to do. Let me know down below if you would prefer to see my bullet journal on the actual first or whether you want to see it on Monday next week, which would be the, what is that, the fourth, the fifth, the fifth let me know down below um i also need to write some lists because you know i'm a list queen and writing lists just calms my anxiety so i've put that down there because i know i'm going to want to write lists of the food and the clothes that i want to take and then i want to make sure i've washed all of our fluffy blankets ready to take and then i put the planning princess down as i need to edit another video before i leave as well to go on holiday i put a full box down just to block off that time and then ended it with another three heart checklist for friday this week i'm not going to be having a new release go up in my shop because obviously if i close my shop next week then you don't want to have a new release up and then you can't purchase it so <laughs> that seems a bit pointless to me so i will get back to having regular new releases once i'm back from holiday and also i have got the day off work as well on friday so i just put that on a quarter box and the script sticker is from my shop i need to go over the plans for my cat marley somebody's coming over to feed him so i've just put a little puppet cat down and just wrote marley plans and then underneath there i put a glitter header just to cover the black line and a long page flag and the little sticker is from the travel sheet he's got like the little safari outfit on he's such a cute dude and that was for me to pack all of our clothes I also want to go and fill up the car with petrol check the tires and the oil and all that kind of thing that you normally do when you go on holiday so I've put that down and I used the um, car icon sticker that came with the kit and then underneath there I used another poppet from the travel sheet he's got like the backpack on and that was to pack the car like I said I'm packing everything Friday but hopefully the majority of it is completely done and stacked and ready throughout the week hopefully <laughs> we all say that at the beginning of the week and when it comes to the end of the week it may not have happened but at least you know I look organized in my planner I also need to cut off my long nails and paint them before I go because long nails and camping don't really mix maybe if I was glamping it would have been fine but making a fire every day and doing all the camping things every day and long nails just it's not a good match so I'll be sorting all of those out on Friday and then for the weekend obviously we are off early Saturday morning so I've put the weekend banner down at the top and I haven't really got anything to put in for the weekend because I obviously I don't know what we're doing but the large puppet there is from the travel sheet and then I'm trying to think if I put anything else down. Oh, I did put that we were going to be stopping for coffee. So once we have left our house, we will drive, get a takeaway coffee, and then away we go. We're off. Also, my pen was starting to run out of ink. It's always the way. I thought it might stretch out until the end, but I did have to switch it out for my other pen, which is like a slightly lighter black. I'm not that bothered really but moving over to the sidebar so I used a full box up at the top just to cover up the calendar and then I used some of the matching washi underneath just to cover up the writing that was there and then I'm still putting in my two habit trackers I always use one for my face which is just to remind myself to do like my moisturizing and kind of skincare and then the other one is for Instagram I could probably not have these because I'm so used to doing my like skincare for example but I just find this to make it really good for making me accountable that's what I was trying to say then my words got jumbled up um if I don't have it in here and I know I don't have to check it off each day I probably would slip and miss a few days 
I've also put a to buy section because as I go through the week, no doubt I will remember something that I have to buy for camping. And then this moth literally flew into my face and landed on my headphones because I was watching a Shane Dawson video while I was filling out my planner. I probably should have put a moth warning in then. I'm sorry if any of you are frightened of moths. I'm really, really sorry. I apologise. Um, all I had left to do was the most bestest part of planning, which is the deco stickers, in my opinion. Um, so I just put these all over the top. I used the sunglasses I just showed you on the poppet. <laughs> he looks so cute with these big sunglasses on. He looks like a little child when you put sunglasses on them. How adorable they look. Anyway, so I put all of those at the top and I used every single one and that was it for this week's plan with me. So I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you did, then make sure you give me a thumbs up. If you are new to my channel, then hello and don't forget to subscribe. I hope you guys are having an amazing week so far and I hope you guys have a lovely week next week and I will see you all when I am back. Bye bye.